everybody. Welcome to Creative by Nature, Art and Life. My name is Donna. Today I've actually got a fairly big Dollar Tree haul to share with you and there are some really exciting new finds for me. So let's get right into it. Okay, so first up, I grabbed these pencil grips. Now I had bought some before and I was actually more after these ones, but I thought, you know what, I'm going to grab these ones as well. And I've bought some before and what I'm going to be doing is using these as adapters for pens to use in my Cricut Joy. So I was playing around one day, but then I've seen how others do it. So I'm going to try it again. If it works, I will definitely share that with you. And then I also grabbed these. I've heard good things about these. I think it was Linda H. I believe it was you that shared these. I can't remember. Sorry. Anyways, she liked them. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to grab these. This is the only color they had. Color set. I'm not sure if they have any other colors. Um, again, I'm going to see if these will work in my Cricut Joy. So my watercolors, um, I just went through them all and I had to throw a bunch of them out. So I thought um, I need to replace them, but I wanted to try the Crafter Square one. Apparently they're not too, too bad considering that they were, you know, so cheap, only $1.25 here in Canada. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to play around with them and see how they are. And then they also had these canvas shape stickers, which I thought was super cool. Uh, I just got the ones with the circles and the hearts, but they had butterflies and they had flowers as well. I just like these two shapes the most. I found these adorable adorable little lanterns they had like a teal blue and a green as well I believe this is supposed to go with like their nautical theme it was just in their oh what section was that I believe what near their candles but I did try one they were quite cute so I'm gonna see what I can do with these they are plastic and I discovered that these kind of like they're not flat as you can see so I'm not sure what I'll do but I'm I'll come up with something. Just grab, grab the two in the off-white. I have never tried the Jot foam mounting tape, so I thought I would give it a try. I use a lot of this. This is a lot thinner than what I usually use, but that's all right. And then I've seen lots of people hauling these stickers. Now my store had a, quite a selection and I really just like these doors, or sorry, books. I thought they were cool. And then I also like these. I've seen lots of people doing some cool things with these ones. So I just grabbed the two sets. They had some new tissue paper in and I love their tissue papers. I use them a lot for decoupage and of course gift wrapping too, but this one was gorgeous. I loved the colors. See, isn't that pretty? I've got some napkins in the birch bark pattern. I love it for decoupage. It is just so, so fun to use. So I got two packages. So these can be used for your feet or for crafting. I love the colors. I thought they were so, so fun. I was gonna use this one for Easter time, but I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna hang on to it because <laughs> my feet are always cold. I love these socks. So I grabbed some more beacon glue. This is the spray. I haven't used it before, so I thought I'd give that a try. And then they had some more of the poster. I have used it a few times now and I actually really like it. I know some people don't care for the smell, but it doesn't bother me too bad. But I've got um, good ventilation in the room that I uh, craft in. So, okay, Dollar Tree has been knocking it out of the park for their wood stuff. I'm so impressed. I just got one of these palettes board signs. Don't know what I'm going to do with it yet, but I liked it. And then I got just one of each. I'm actually thinking I should have probably grabbed four of these because now I have an idea for them. But you live and learn, right? I'm sure they'll get more of these in. They've had them on and off, I think. If not, I know I can get these at Dollarama as well. So and then they had the round one. thought that was really cool. I actually kind of like this just as is. Okay, so my friend Dawn from Say Let Be Dawn, she was given an embellished box. And I had never, ever seen that before. It must be something new. People are using these Dollar Tree storage boxes. Or sorry, drawers. <laughs> and they're embellishing them. And they're putting embellishments inside. And I thought that was just so, so cool. So I just grabbed one. I wanted to just 
try it out and see what I can come up with. This has got to be one of my most favorite finds that Dollar Tree has come out with. Isn't this just gorgeous? They were fully stocked again. I've bought these before and I've used them. There's so many different ways you can use them because these can be taken apart and this little clip can be removed too. So, so I'm jumping into their kitchen section quickly here and they had some new tea towels and I thought this one was so, so cute. But it was just so fun. The only thing with these, they don't dry really well, but you know what? I thought I don't care. <laughs> and then they were stocked up on these bamboo wood, bamboo cutting boards again love these so much we use them all the time in our kitchen but they can also be used for crafting you know I know I said I would be using my stash more and being careful what <laughs> being mindful of what I get and then Dollar Tree just keeps bringing out more and more and more cool stuff I'm like oh I really need to just stop going in I found these love these I love corrugated tin so fun. Now I grabbed two with the house and then two with the hearts. The thing is, these can be removed, these embellishments. And I thought, like, I, I'm going to use these without the wood pieces. And I thought I would more be more likely to use the hearts and the houses than the other shapes. Like they had um, a star and oh, I can't remember the other shape. But yeah, I just knew that I would use these shapes. For different projects so got the four hey i love these so so much they are the wall shelves and i am in shock that they have these my store is like she told me today she goes you know we are slow about a month behind everybody else but they do eventually get stuff it just takes them a little longer but look now this is veneer on the top and then it's press board underneath but i don't care that doesn't bother me any Love this. I think this is going to be so cool to play with. My um, seasonal section, like the summer and the spring, it was really, really sparse and picked over. But I found this and I just thought it was so cute. Love flowers. Okay, so I got this mirror. I have an idea in mind. I just have to see if I have enough of the one item that I need to do the project. I'm trying to shine it so you guys don't see my reflection. <laughs> mess today oh man we had to do so many errands today my daughter oldest daughter had her first driving lesson today I mean she has been driving already we've taken her out but anyways had to take her to the city so she could start her driving lessons in the city so we had to do some running around and of course we stopped at Dollar Tree but yeah I'm just a hot mess today <laughs> anyway so I got this mirror I was so excited. I was in shock. My store got these. I was so hoping that they find or bring these in. So I got that. And then another really exciting find was this. Isn't that just so, so cool? I love it. Love the mason jar shape. I have no idea what I'm going to do with it yet, but they also had like a cloud shape and I believe a speech bubble. And then like kind of like an oblong um, rectangle, like the corners are rounded off. And then, yeah, there was a few other shapes, but I just love this one. This was my favorite. So I grabbed that and I was, again, I'm so excited I got this. So they were fully restocked with succulents and I had seen these in the past and I wasn't really drawn to them. But now, I don't know, I like them. Oh, you know what? I actually prefer this with the lighter green over the bright green, but I didn't even notice that. Of course, I'm a nut for succulents. <laughs> anyway, so we'll see what I come up with these. So some of the newer finds were these drawstring bags. So they had two different sizes. This one was 11 and a half by five and a half, and this one is 14 inches by 11 and a half. So um, you can use your vinyl on these. So I thought that would be really cool. Like you could use iron on, which I plan on doing. So I was in shock that my store had all these vinyl cutting tools. I was so excited. I grabbed two of the spatula, two of the scraper. I grabbed three of the pickers. Now, I had um, accidentally bent the tip on mine, so I got one to replace it, 
And then what I plan on doing is having one set as a backup. And then I am hoping to do giveaways, but I'm not going to do that until I reach 1000 subscribers. So keep that in mind. So when I get to a thousand subscribers, I will be having a giveaway. And the other thing I'm going to be sharing will be the cutting mats. I am going to throw in two cutting mats. The cutting mat hack for Sizzix machine is my most viewed video. And there were a lot of people saying that they couldn't find these in their store. Well, my store was stocked up on them again. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to grab two to include in a giveaway with these tools for when I reach a thousand subscribers. So I'm setting that goal and <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I am, I believe, just shy of 600. So I still have a little ways to go, but hey, I got to get cracking here and get to work and hopefully I'll get there. Okay, the find of the day were the vinyl papers. Ah! <laughs> oh, I was so, so excited. So beyond excited that they had all this for our cutting machines. Now they did have the... Um, there was a textured vinyl and then they had the uh, just a regular vinyl and those came in colors that I don't usually use so I thought you know what I'm not going to get something that I'm not going to use although they did have some black and white but uh, I have lots of black and white so I just grabbed these I got all of the glittered ones silver gold black and rose gold and then i wasn't shocked that they had faux leather now i'm hoping that this will be used be usable on my joy we'll see if not then for sure my sizzix machine or i can even hand cut it for different projects now i just got it in the black white and the brown i'm not that crazy about the brown but i thought i'm gonna see if i can stain it in a color that i like better I just got the colors that I liked. So seriously, Dollar Tree, you guys have been doing so awesome with all your crafting supplies. My Dollar Tree got a bunch of these floor rugs again, and I've gotten two of them in the green, which I love, but I don't know, I really like this gray. They also had black, and I can't remember the other color, of course, but I just grabbed the two gray. I thought they were just beautiful. I'm not sure what I'll do, but... So let me know some of the fun things you're finding near your stores and also which item here you like the most. Ugh, Dollar Tree. You gotta stop making me spend money. <laughs> just kidding. All kidding aside. Yeah, I hope you're all doing well. We will see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.